1981, Dave Smith and Chet Wood gave the world MIDI. MIDI allows keyboards to talk to other keyboards and other devices. This gives you one keyboard that can drive many keyboards at once. We can create a complex arrangement of instruments controlled by a single clock and it's absolutely fantastic. But MIDI hasn't really crossed over to the guitar. So why is that? Well, it has been tried. So you can get pickups that listen to each string individually and convert that to a digital MIDI signal. But the problem with this is the guitar's not played like a keyboard. So it just sounds odd. So you can kind of change your playing style and adjust for this. I'm just not sure. I think when you look at the air guitar world, we all know the rules of air guitar. It's written in our DNA. We strum with our right hand and the angle of the neck that we make with our left hand defines the pitch. Maybe this is the way MIDI guitar should work. So to achieve this, I've got an Arduino. This can be the brains, a MIDI connector, an accelerometer. This can calculate what angle it's at and then a joystick that we can use to mimic strumming with. So let's push this together and see what it looks like. Okay, so with a little bit of code, we have this. So as always, we need to find a guitar to be blessed with this greatness. And I think this Telecaster will be absolutely perfect. I've designed a 3D printable case that's going to screw on. It's not going to add any extra holes. We're going to use the holes in the scratch plate. And I think this is going to look really cool. So let's get this printed out. Okay, let's put this on the guitar. This is looking really cool. So I'm just going to try and use only the MIDI. And I'm going to use this Crave Monosynth to give us the sound. I've plugged the guitar in and when I strum it, we get different notes. Now, because this is MIDI, we can control absolutely anything. So now we can play MIDI monosynths or whatever we decide to plug this into and program for, as well as the guitar. Definitely need a bit of time to master this, but what do you think? I'm gonna try this with a different patch. I'm gonna try this with a Moog subsequent 37. But yeah, I think this is really cool. It opens up a lot of new options to guitar players. And I'm really interested to see what you think of this. Have you played a MIDI guitar? Have you wanted to try one and just not got around to it? Let me know where we can take this next. And that's it for now. And I think there is a few uh, ideas to take this further. So stick around.